below and you might see the title of this video and think what why is he sorry i'm sorry let's just say because i haven't done a video in 10 days more than 10 i think but the reason is i was on a holiday down the great ocean road only the aussies will know this one i was on a holiday in the great ocean road around i was staying at apollo bay for about 10 nights so i'm sorry that i didn't get to do two things I haven't uploaded video for ages and that i haven't i wasn't going to do an april fool's prank i was planning on then i had the holiday and i couldn't i didn't have the time to do an april fool's with them video where I could do pranks and stuff because that was on holiday as well and a third one I'm sorry I didn't get a vlog of my holiday I will get a vlog hopefully of camp my school camp and I think that will be quite exciting but to say sorry to you I've got a surprise it's a haul so yeah the first one I want to show is the one that I got from the library. It is Percy Jackson, The Ultimate Guide. Yeah, so I got this from the library. As you know, my favourite author is Rick Cry Um, It was really good. Really good. And, like, if you don't know what this is, it's an ultimate guide to Percy Jackson, basically. It's got all different parts in it as well. It's got all the illustrations and stuff like all the right illustrations and all that. It's got all different parts in it. Let me just. It's got Percy Jackson is part one, and yeah, there's a fury. So it's also got a map of Camp Half Blood, and yeah, there's all different kind of things like. Ten signs that you may be a half blood, and then another part, life at camp. So it's got all the gods as well. So it's got lovely illustrations in it, as you can see. So that is it. So I'm really looking forward. I was really looking forward to reading this, and it turned out to be a masterpiece. I've read about three quarters of it. Now, next one I want to show you, you might know this one. It came out April the 5th. As you know, Trials of Apollo is coming out May the 3rd. This is April the 5th. And, remember the Kane Chronicles and Percy Jackson crossover stories? It's got all three of them in one book. Um, it's also got... The first chapter of Charles of Pollock and the first chapter of Monkey's Chase. So this came out a couple of days ago. I got it when I was on holiday. Got it the exact day when it came out. Demigods and Magicians. Believe it or not, I've read it all. I read it in a couple of nights. I loved it and I've already read the first chapter of Charles of Polo. It was amazing. It was so good. This is only the Australian cover. You can get the American cover if you're watching this from America. So, lovely. It's a good book. And, so yeah. I, my favourite short story was probably The Crown of Pollock Me, then The Son of Sobek, and then The Staff of Cerebus. And, now that I've read that chapter, I'm really excited because that was a mind-blowing part piece. Also, if you want to read the um, first chapter of the third chapter, this has got the first, but the third chapter of Trials of Apollo, it's on the internet. I'll have that website down there. And, yeah, hopefully you'll enjoy reading that the chapter so again i'm sorry and i love the support that i'm getting from you guys so yeah this will be going on my shelf 
that will be going in my library section because so that's not actually mine. And for other good news, you don't have to watch this anybody who doesn't live in Australia because this is one of my favourite sports, my second favourite sport. Only Aussies and a couple of people in, around the world will know this. That my favourite football team, the Bulldogs, are playing Hawthorne. They are on top of the ladder. Oh, just so you know. <laughs> oh, well, my friend is going to get really mad at me. My friend went, is an Essendon supporter. And he went, since Essendon have lost half their team, he was going for Freo. Bulldogs thrashed Freo by about 63 points. Yeah. So, yeah, that's just... Yeah, that's good news. And we also got got the Saints. Good game, good game. And now we're facing the top team, Hawthorne. We are still on top, though, and Hawthorne is eight, so that's good news. And I'm going to the game. I'll try and see if I can get a vlog on it. For all those people that you don't know football, you can watch that vlog. Try to get a vlog on it. See how that's going to go. And... So I want to say thank you and sorry and this will be the end of my video.